Hello everybody, welcome to CCL Season 52. Oh wow, we've started with a blitz. Um, we've got Nidisius with humans versus Alma with Dark Elves. And in the booth with me is the man, the myth, the legend, Flicky Flack. Don't mention Billy Elliot to him. <laughs> um, yeah. Your favourite game, this, your favourite racial matchup, eh, Flicky? Yeah, I think so. There's, uh, there's, I found there's always something interesting going on in, uh, in this matchup. <laughs> interesting, like getting your catcher served instantly. Yes. <laughs> yeah, yeah, those kind of interesting <laughs> things. Yeah. <laughs> okay, is that so, enough? Blitz for the humans. Which mm. really puts a dampener on uh, things for the elves. Hmm. Especially dark elves, which aren't particularly quick to get back and uh, try and recover. Yeah, makes the catch. Yeah. So, we're definitely going to try and surf, right? Yes, it's. I mean, this isn't what I would have done, but who can say if it's good or bad? <laughs> it might be bad. Spoilers. <laughs> Oh, he just gets the put. Just gets the power. A mighty so, blow, though. Yep. Just as done. Okay, the ball goes deep. That's one of the better squares that it could have gone to. Mm. Ball's deep. Yeah, it's interesting, isn't it? So we've got we've got a movement, some sidestep, some guard, loads of mighty blow, two mighty blow. I think there's actually a third that's missed next because there's a couple of uh, a couple of dark elf loners, and. Uh, I think there was yeah. two edge five, but there's only one edge five here. And uh, the humans, it's pretty, low, it's pretty kind of low TV team, but also pretty efficient uh, human team, isn't it? With guard on the catcher, um, just guard, mostly just guard on the blitzers, uh, killer blitzer. Pretty interesting, and a movement up. Uh, strength blitz is always nice. Mm. Big GFI. Have we got any tackle anywhere? Um, Not for the elves. One tackle mighty, I think I see for the humans. Yeah, frenzy jugs, no piling on. Um, but yeah, no tackle at all for the elves is pretty shit. It is a bit, because humans can, you know, they can still pop up with a few blodgers here and there. Mm. Oh wow, we're making this a 3D. <laughs> I mean, I guess because he's already got two assists in. I don't know, I think maybe it's just Blitz. Just 2D him and then, like, I don't know, Blitz someone else and then 2D him is probably what I would have done. That's, but... a, that's a Frenzy Jug's first Blitzer. So we've seen his, uh, I guess, his route through uh, CCL was a lot of surfing players. Mm. But even with a punning on a foul, I just I just hate this idea of committing a lot of players there. I would have wanted to yeah. harass him downfield, you know, try and pin him in. And make something happen. Personally, oh, I oh, jammed the tap with the raid, but falling one short of the alert. Oh, tragedy! I don't get to see Flicky walking into a lamp post. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thanks. <laughs> That's a, that's got to be one of the all-time great Red Bull clips, honestly, Flicky. Really. I love your Glorious. clips. <laughs> no, yeah, there, there were a few good angry clips over the, over the last and couple I of years, haven't they? Yeah. I will defend. God tier on yeah, I think that one is my favourite, though. Oh, dear, I missed that. Sorry, uh... Give me a moment. So we've got two teams that seem to be determined to stay away from each other. We've got a big clump of humans on one side, a massive clump of elves on the other. Mm. <laughs> My win rate brings all the boys to the yard. Thank you very much, Aurelensis Sting. Fantastic. 
for 66 months. That is unbelievable, isn't it? Five and a half years. That is amazing. The country wizard himself. <laughs> yeah. Oh, wow. Big Kaz. Oh, hello, yeah. And Apo comes in. Which is a bit risk gonna be a bit dangerous for the uh for the yeah. devils, isn't it? I mean it's a nice player, but hang on, it's just a is that just a dodger? Yeah, dodge dodge blitzer. But I mean it was guaranteed to work, wasn't it? And there's only one there's only one mighty ball, yeah. I guess, is what he's thinking. Yeah, sure. Competitive, isn't it? Competitive to win the yeah, game. Yeah, I guess there's no point keeping your team alive if you're going out of the the tournament, so Mm. Yeah, yeah, I like it. Oh, and now mighty blow back. Yeah. Oh, just a stun again. So inducement wise, there was none. That's weird, isn't it? We got a, an exact match. Mm. Or close to anywhere. A fair game of blood ball. What's this? <laughs> I guess it must be exact with the the forty, unless you didn't have the money to spend. Mm. Oh wow! Or you'd at least have a babe. Now the apple looks genius as uh, as the gang foul happens, but well, yeah. not that genius because he got sent off and he used the apple. So <laughs> yeah. Well, with double mighty blow, he might be able to uh, to do a bit of damage now. The apple's gone. Mm. Um, it's probably not going to make much difference on numbers, but if you can get a good player out, it, it could be important. Yep. Because humans have bench. They do, yeah. Three bench. Uh, well, two bench. Sorry, not three. And then this catcher is a pretty decent one-turner. I mean, he's not really, because he's edge three, but you know. Yeah. <laughs> They have re-roll that for the surf. And with two re-rolls, I think that's a bit dodgy, but yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I really don't like how the humans have played this really. I think they should have uh Well it's just not getting in front, right? Like the no, game why is here he? and he's got th four people behind the ball, four yeah. people over here, and there's oh, two people no. here. Oh, he get didn't move that blodge guard. No, this is a bit crap. I wouldn't he have taken it. I also wouldn't have Blood taken guard. either of these hits, by the way. I wouldn't have I personally, I would have taken either of these. I would have been putting this guard in there, punching this guy, blitzing this guy, and getting the whole team there. You know, like a, like a post yes. breakthrough Dakar. Yeah, absolutely. He gets to surf here, which is fine. Yeah, surfs. Like you say, it's fine. And he's got time, but that was just like, that was such a great opportunity to break through. Yeah, yeah I would have definitely wanted to break through. I guess the fact that the, the humans have, have, like, haven't like have shown that they want to stop you scoring. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> it makes you think, well, maybe I won't uh, need to. Yeah. Just I'll... chill out here for a bit longer. Yeah, I'll have, I'll have another easy chance next turn, so might as yeah. well just oh. take the serve. Oh wow! Oh man, one in eighty-one. Yeah. Will he take the space this time? But, but now it's harder, right? Because he doesn't have that witch elf in contact. So it's like, yeah, it is literally harder. He's f the team's further back, and he doesn't have yeah. witch in contact. Yeah, and so it's hard to to sort of get beyond the last uh, the last human now, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I don't don't understand. <laughs> That's pretty sick. <laughs> Hello, PC. Be careful to not, not stop the blitz on the guard. Hmm. Oh, you mean this one for the humans? I don't know. I was more the position of the humans, I thought. I yeah. like I just didn't like it. I thought everything the humans did was terrible. <laughs> I wouldn't single out <laughs> the blitz on the guard. <laughs> oh wow, Dublay skulls and eats it because he's only got a reroll, so I guess he's saving it for the uh Oh 
for the uh, for the H three one turn. Mm. The humans couldn't really surf the witch, right? Like they couldn't really. I know they technically could, but they'd have to dodge in here on a four, on a four plus a uh, five plus. Sorry, so wasn't reasonable for them to surf the witch. So this drive is done. Let's see if that re-roll comes into effect. Yeah. Probably should have moved the ball there in case of the one in twelve nine six. There was no literally no reason not to move the ball first. No. No, absolutely. Safety first. Yeah, fair enough, Doug, to the dog, fair. <laughs> And now, amazingly, having four people behind the ball has turned into a bit of a disaster. Who, who could have foreseen this? <laughs> Not me. Not us. <laughs> and the four people who were irrelevantly standing over <laughs> here are still irrelevantly standing over here. <laughs> the two people that were pretending to get in the way didn't really get in the way. I, yeah, this was a disaster of a defence. Yeah, I mean, that, that turn when everyone basically stayed where they were or went deeper down the pitch was was not good at all yeah so yeah if you're watching this Odysseus, it's no offense you know trying to be helpful um and obviously helpful to everybody watching as well isn't that's the thing um because you would well statistically most people watching aren't as good as chalice coaches are are they you know that's that's got to be facts hasn't it probably yeah yeah. Oh wow, Dubler skulls again. Um, so yeah, like that just wasn't doing a whole lot. Like these four, like you can't afford to get behind the ball, especially when they're deep, right? Like even more yeah. reason when they're deep to just stay in front of them and make it hard to get past. Like fair enough if like you know if the ball's here, then getting behind to try and get a sack to stop them scoring is a lot more viable because it's really hard to stop them getting in from like five squares away. But when the ball's all the way back here, just stay in front of them and make it hard for them. Yeah. Yeah, you've got to be patient, wait for the elves to come to you, make it difficult. Mm. Well, I think you should have done Odysseus. <laughs> I think you should have tried to defend. Like, it's hard, but like, it can happen, right? We've all rolled snakes as, as elves. I mean, the, the, okay, get some attrition there. <laughs> Both ways. I I just don't like it. I think you've got to try and stop stop him scoring. It, it's like you can roll double ones. Like obviously it's harder without tackle or with one tackle when he was on the pitch. But I think you've got to try and stop. Got to try and stop him scoring. I I think. Like you can all. Do you know what I mean? Like it's. PC's dwarves, I couldn't stop scoring. <laughs> I didn't try. Like you're not getting chewed up and spat out by trying to stop the dark elf scoring here. You can you can get in the way and hold space and try and stop them getting through. Yeah, make them make them keep rolling dice. I mean, like you say, you've rolled dub skulls. They can easily <laughs> dub one if you just keep uh, keep boxing them in as best you can. Mm. But yeah, there's never any malice. We're not J5. <laughs> He's the malicious one. Yep. <laughs> and uh, also, PC, I saw that, but I, I took the high road and ignored you. You prick. <laughs> hey! <laughs> Banter. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> that moment when PC came out of the half for Jimmy. Oh no, man. How unlucky can you get? Amazing. How unlucky can you get? Ooh, didn't, this guy didn't come back. Could have put three sidesteppers on the LOS, which probably would have been worth it. I uh, Yeah, with, with so few players left, it's maybe it's worth to put the three sidesteppers on the line, but I don't think it's worth putting two sidesteppers on the line when the two sidesteppers are so good. And you'd have to put a non sidestep on the LOS anyway. Yeah. Oh. We're actually doing it properly without the whole method. Lovely. And a 3D to start. Wonderful.
Hey, here we go. <laughs> Been a misclick. <laughs> what? And then use the pow? What the fuck? Oh no! What is this? What's happened? <laughs> <laughs> oh god! Literally the worst. Is this is this a rebel audition or what? <laughs> oh god! Oh god, that was, yeah, yeah, that was... <laughs> Not what I would have done. <laughs> Who can say if it was cut off? <laughs> PC. <laughs> yeah, his, his fiance took over. Oh my god. Yeah. Yeah, could have still scored as well. That's the irony is, it was he was actually in range and still could have just scored. Amazing. <laughs> Amazing. I've never seen the Sopranos, really. Funny enough. Have you never seen the Sopranos, Jim? Never seen the Sopranos. Oh my goodness me! What have you been doing with your life? I ask myself that every single day. <laughs> <laughs> the answer is playing Blood Bowl. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, well, God. at least it hasn't been wasted. Yeah. Yeah. God. No, I, I, Astro it was, it was being oh, funny. Oh, good, Astro Tot's here. It was being, it was a, yeah. That's because that's what he was saying. That's why I said <laughs> Right. <laughs> Pitch Invasion. Ooh. That's pretty horrible, isn't it? But I like having the two players back there, you know, in case of a thrown rock. Yeah. Um, and a bit of protection against, you know, you know blitz and stuff. Oh, wow. Dell's very much running out of players. Yeah, needs to keep this up, keep the attrition going. I've never seen the wire as well, funnily enough. Lots of people like the wire, don't they? Yeah, I haven't seen that one. It took me a long time to watch True Detective. That was really good. Breaking Bad? Have you watched? Yeah, you I watched saw Breaking, Breaking Bad. Bad. Yeah, I like Breaking Bad. Yeah. It, weird though, because like the problem with Breaking Bad is it's just really weird that they have an unlikable main character. Like that's what. Like I thought it was good. I just didn't particularly enjoy it. Like Breaking Bad, I thought was good, but I didn't particularly enjoy it. <laughs> if that makes sense. <laughs> because like you've got a main character that you just don't like or care about. And can't root for. <laughs> like, it's just weird, isn't it? It is. Well, I'm still going for it, down to like eight players. Pretty rowdy. Yeah, I think so. I think he's got to tr try and, yeah, split the team. Get 2 0 up. GG. I guess, and if you make it more about the ball, you, he stops maybe attritioning as much. Mm. I think he's done an okay job. Yeah, it's pretty Letting, decent. I mean, humans are fast. Yeah, that's the thing. The humans have already got the ball and they can move nine, so they can just cage up over here, can't they? Yeah. So they don't really... Waste ground, that wrestle catcher. So basically, he's, he's really only the, the downed player. Yeah. And that one lineman over on the right. Really nice.
Oh, GFI. Oh, yeah, because he didn't realise this one had sidestep, I guess. <laughs> I think his plan was to come in with this one, wasn't it? Because he moved this guy back, which obviously he shouldn't have done. So that was like, these were around the wrong way. These two were around the wrong way, because I could have saved that GFI. I probably forgot sidestep. So I'll hit Such these two. Annoying skill. It, is, yeah. it is super annoying, especially when you... Uh, when you brain fart like I did against Kadenik, which cost me a match. <laughs> yeah, he's a, he's a rather good coach, isn't he, Kadenik? Puts a lot of pressure on. Mm. Forces mistakes, constant, uh, constant good positioning. Mm. Uh, interesting defense from uh, Alma here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Taking a leaf out of his opponent's book there. Yep. Yep. You want some space? Here it is. Yeah, I need to be fair, he hasn't got that many players, but yeah, yeah this was But he's Obviously. yeah, he's been sucked into to trying to have a bit of a fight and it hasn't worked. Yep. Yeah, you gotta gotta take this space. Hundred percent. Deep it's the witch elf, probably. No. Oh, going for the edge man. Gets him. I quite like nailing the witch elf here, because then that gives you this guy to run up to here, doesn't it? Which is pretty good. Yeah, it, that would be nice, yeah. And obviously she's armor seven with mighty blow, so like it's a pretty good pretty good that but I guess this guy is defenseless and then coming up here lets you uh lets you rescue this guy a bit. But like you could have just dodged off as well right at the end of the turn. Yeah. So we're going to have a similar game to last time, heading into overtime. Elves will need the ball to stand a chance. Oh, no. Well, that makes it a bit closer. That's a little bit, yeah. That's a uh, God Mighty, was it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, God Mighty Blitzer gone. And another. Killed. Mm-hmm. Can we make it three for three? <laughs> if we had, I think the uh, the Delves would be running back on mass next turn. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Yeah, I mean, we see this occasionally, don't we, from Skaven, where they have a, a big fight and then all of a sudden everyone just dashes to the ball yeah. and forces them in, gives themselves a two-turner. Yeah, you really got to be wary of that against, against Skaven particularly. But like in every yeah. game, right? It, it wouldn't matter what the races are. But that's always a possibility. It's just with with Skaven with their speed, it's like ridiculous, isn't it? Yeah, and they can have a they can have a proper good fight. Uh huh. You know, they've usually got a dirty player or two. They've got you know their their blitzers are often nice killers. And and because of the guts of sackers, isn't it? That's the thing. Like you still have to protect the ball against them. So this yeah. kind of thing where you can't really send like five guys to cage and five guys to fight because then their ten will kick the shit out of your five. <laughs> yeah. So it's like it's really hard against Rats, you've really got to keep your team together against them so they can't just Yeah. Like tee off on you. Yeah, because cause then you get jumped, like you say, by by you know, two or three just perfect sack pieces. Mm. But the elves just gonna keep having a fight. Yeah, I mean, it's fair enough now, right? He ain't stopping them. Yeah, absolutely. Just that's it. We've got double mighty blow. Here's another one. Yeah. Oh, he gets him. He gets the tackle. Kill. Lovely. Huge, that's it's huge roll. if that stays out as well. If that yeah. stays out for OT, flip me. Yeah, that is massive. Was this a, was this another fair game? It looks like it, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh no, this was the same fair game. The other one had skip. It is, yeah. It's the second half of the same fair game, Jim, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
this is why they all come to watch your stream, Jim. Brilliant. Yep, yep. I know my stuff. <laughs> it's the expert advice you don't get anywhere else. <laughs> hey. oh. And now got to re-roll it because he yeah. exposed the ball to do that blitz. Jesus the Christ. The cage is wide open. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, that was... That was... <laughs> <laughs> that was painful. <laughs> oh, dear me. Oh, God. <laughs> I, I wish I'd been watching when Art cast that play. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, there are certain moments when Art really gets in his element, isn't it? Yeah, that was that was appalling. That like that was genuinely just appalling, right? Like if you're gonna do that play, move the ball over there and have these three here or something, like just yeah, and then don't re-roll yeah. it because it, this is going to overtime. You're one nil down. You win this game by taking it to overtime. Therefore, you have to maximize re-rolls, not just for equity, but for like actually winning in overtime. So yeah, yeah, there was no reason for that whatsoever because he'd moved. The cage pieces. He he moved the back side of the cage and then decided to blitz with the <laughs> the front, the front. <laughs> yeah. which yeah, very strange. And now this is walking Alma up, and he thinks, right, well, let's let's try. Yeah, let's stop go. This. Let's give myself a two turn. Mm. And you know, and that's the point now where you can say maybe he should have been trying to give himself a two turn earlier because. You know, Dark Elves of the two turn is very, very reasonable that he scores yeah. and wins. And if he loses the toss, there's a very reasonable chance that the human score. So, yeah. you know, I, I, I'm, I'm not. You know, I, I think Alma's strategy of just fighting and ignoring the ball was pretty terrible, honestly. Because even down players, I mean, it kind of worked out a little bit, but he should have mm -hmm. gone back earlier. You know, like, yeah. like how do you win as Alma? Like, is it? Are you just reduced to winning the toss in overtime? Maybe you were at some point, but after winning the fight there, the moment he removed the uh, tackle mighty is when he should have moved everyone back. So he's now, like we say, he, he's definitely got a chance at forcing a two turn. Oh, wow. What, what, what do you think, Flicky, of the witch elf here? Witch Elf could have blitzed him 2D yeah. into 1D and then a push, push the, push the thing. Oh yeah, that was the play I think. Yeah, and forced the score. Yeah. Nice spot. Yeah, I think that's. I think that's it. Helmy's, Helmy's, well done. <laughs> yeah, that was. It wasn't. It wasn't even that lucky either, was it? Two in the one. I mean, I saw it as well, but I'll give credit to Helmy's. <laughs> Yeah, that was that was probably that was probably uh, the play for Alma to do. Tell you what, you can uh, yeah, it's it's looking very this is still very strong, unlikely isn't now, isn't it, to uh, to get the the, the turn eight score, the turn sixteen score. Yeah, there he goes. Needed a dodge as well. Yeah. Yeah, but then it worked out pretty well anyway, right? Like, there was just a dodge to score, so actually this worked out pretty well, what Alma did. And it was probably less risky, so it might have just been better anyway. <laughs> yeah, yeah, by the end, the way he, pile, he was able to pile everyone in, sure. Mm. It's, yeah. it's always a, a crowd pleaser, that kind of player, though, isn't it? It's a, yeah. it's a clever, little, clever little spot. Won't she plays like this anywhere else, guys? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, everyone everyone likes the chains and the surfs, don't they, for sure. And it's like, because there's just not that many cool things you can do in a game of Blood Bowl, is there, you know? Like, there's not. Like, relentlessly optimal positioning is not exactly... It's not interesting. Like, it's not interesting, it is interesting. It's, but it's not flashy, is it? Like, the flashy yeah. players are the chain pushers, basically. Yeah, absolutely. So... So it is the flashy thing to do. And that's why we love a Dave or Surf. Hmm. Yeah, it's flashy, isn't it? 
flashy, flashy chains, flashy surfs. That's it. But I mean, this two turn with three re rolls should be pretty easy, shouldn't it? Plus movement, guy, sidestep. Yeah. A gaping hole in the defense. <laughs> a gaping wide hole. <laughs> And I mean, okay, it's hard to defend, right? Because they haven't got 11 players, so you could blitz yeah. somebody through, but now you don't even need to blitz through. No. Oh, that's... That's an awful kick, though. Ooh. Could have ran around the back and served him, there. Mmm. That would have been a player. Yeah, just a GFI as well. Yeah. I mean, I would rather not, but... <laughs> I would have rather just, probably just... I don't know. I don't know what, who I would have blitzed. Yeah, maybe I was... You see, maybe you put a guard in and hit him, but you can't. But If that's just a push, it's pretty horrible for... Oh, okay. I thought he was going through the... the... Gonna try and get through the gap in the middle, maybe do a pass oh. to someone up in the cage, but he's just gonna yeah, keep up. Hang back on no, that's, fair. that's fair. It's something I don't do enough uh, when I'm playing Elves is is keep keep it deep and use a relay man. Yeah, I don't really, I don't really like that to be honest. I would have rather the way this setup was, I would have rather just got the ball in a cage there yeah. on this turn. I think it wasn't that hard to do. Um, This is probably going to be all right. Which goes down, shows a nice bit of cleavage on the way. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Way. It's not. It's not troll, but cleavage. But you know, <laughs> you take what you can in this world. Fucking troll butts. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. It's literally the only thing that's going to keep Blood Bowl 3 alive. The absolute state of Blood Bowl 3 Discord. <laughs> <laughs> and that's the people I decided to get into an argument with. <laughs> that's what you're dealing with. <laughs> <laughs> right, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So, yep, so you hand off to the Witch Elf, she passes to this guy. And yep. then you uphill there to score. Easy. Easy. What could be easier? What could go wrong? <laughs> Starting with the passes as well, like the handoffs and passes. And... Oh, wow, well, passing to this one, okay. No. Oh. Oh, oh, no. Did a double GFI, so. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now, I'm pretty sure that was wrong because this guy's movement seven, isn't he? Yeah. So let's pause it here. Could have just passed to him without the GFIs, and then he goes yeah. one, two, three, four, five, six, seven GFI. So it was better to just pass to him. Obviously, the double one would have made it fail anyway, but that was just better. I guess you could argue getting the SPP on the other guy is better, but who cares about the SPP? All right, overtime it is. Mm hmm. Who's gonna win? Where does it fall? It's Alma. Gone for the JF logo. Great choice. <laughs> Always. So this oh, the guy stays out. So again, we've got ten ten humans to stop the score. Yeah. Is he going to go for the same kind of defense? It looks similarly bad. Ooh. It looks like he's going to go rule of five. Set rule of five. Even worse. Like okay. literally even worse. Or is he going cups? No, he's going offset rule of five. So the offset rule of five is great for stopping people, yeah. you know, for protecting your players. And yep. for stopping a score on turn eight. Yes. Not for maintaining so options against bash teams, especially. Yeah. 
it's not good at stopping a score that can be scored at any time. That's the thing. Yeah. Because the point of trap space is, yes, you're allowing somebody to go down here, but if they go down here, you'll be able to move people around and shut them down so that all they can do is, like, so they can't go forward or they can score. <laughs> yeah. And the Dark Elves in this position will choose score. <laughs> yes, you, you give them the space so you can slam in the side and, like you say, force them in early or, or make them go backwards. Hmm. The problem is you can't do full chevrons right because you're down a player. So it, it is a tough, it is a tough defense for the humans. But you have to cover the breadth of the field, I think, because it's too easy for Dells to just score. Like yeah, problem. I mean, if you're gonna, I think if you're gonna leave a, a gap, it's got to be in the middle. I think you have to cover the flanks. Put your strength four lad, like just put him up the middle on his own and cover the wide with with two players each. Yeah. Or three, yeah, three sort of two in the wide zone, one supporting, and then the strength of four lad just sits in the middle. I don't like this. I don't like this pass to this guy. Just pass it to this guy and fucking go down on the sideline, you know? Mm. You can see one someone trying to protect the. so he can't get round and an elf screen him, but. Mm. I mean, this is a pretty good spot for him, but I would have just put the ball on a board. It's it. a nice square. It is a nice square. Maybe, maybe the oh. mighty blow could have held the ball there. Eh? Maybe the mighty blow could have held the ball. So you could swap these around, and then you've got the ball on the sidestep of it. Eh? The witch elf goes down. Mm. So the back, the back is open. The back door is open, and we're going to get a wrestle hit. Yep. Yeah. Two assists, gets the three, uh, the 2D. Oh, strip pow. And no sidestep, so goes into oh, the crowd. Oh my goodness me. Where's that ball gone? I can't see it. Um, oh my god, the witch. The oh, witch come had, back in. The witch had two chances <laughs> to catch. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, and then a GFI. Oh my goodness, what else can happen this turn? It's crazy, isn't it? I guess the move guy's picking it up at the end. Yeah. At least he's gonna try. Flip me. Not the best two turn attempt I've ever seen. <laughs> no, I mean, it, it would have been fine without the witch going down. But still, once again, I'm sure, you know, a better way of getting that. Sorted without, you know, the one in 36 fail. Yeah. Four rerolls for Alma still. Wishing it was Blood Bowl 2020 rules, probably. <laughs> then, a beautiful psychic! I would head to have. That's pretty nice from Alma, to be fair. Sucks that there's a tackle here, but what can you do? Sorry if anyone uh, heard that. It was my five-year-old who's become obsessed with uh, YouTube videos about Among Us. He's walking around with a uh, rather loud video on carrying a knife. Plastic, <laughs> plastic knife, but still. <laughs> a little bit worried. Glorious flicky. <laughs> Oh my goodness, what did I miss? Have we just had a GFI to win? We, we had two GFIs and... Uh, Double GFI to win the match and it's failed. Yeah. Oof. <laughs> Third commentator, best commentator, yeah. <laughs> Among Us. The best Among Us videos are of course on right here on this channel with the <laughs> Blood Bowl Among Us. <laughs> Oh wow, lovely, uh, lovely pick up and scoot off from the humans. Do you follow there? Or do you, I guess you've got to to put tackle on the witch and the other guy. But surfing that guy would be really good. Full pow. Yeah. Else cage the ball a little bit. Looking rather grim now. Oh, where's he okay, going? We're not going to cage the ball a little bit. Now, has he has he not spotted the? 
and five <laughs> lads just lurking, ready to ready yep. to go. I mean, I thought that was the idea of hitting with this guy, so yeah. that if you power him, you can put a guy there and a guy here and have a clean yeah. ball. Obviously wants to give the elves a, a sporting chance to get back into a game that they've already lost twice. <laughs> <laughs> wow, scathing from... <laughs> I know. Sorry, that was that was a bit much, wasn't it? <laughs> but I mean, this this was terrible. Like this yeah. is genuine. Like like they're elves, you know. This was also trouble from Alma with Edge Five, but never mind. It's worse giving just elves a free shot at the ball instead of like f like you had two players right there to protect it. Yeah, and he ran his guard away. It's just yeah, literally ran both players decision. that could have protected away. Like that's. Is that chalice nerves, you know, like fatigue, mental fatigue? Maybe. Don't know how long the game lasted in real life, but uh, that was that was pretty appalling, honestly. Yeah, you can imagine with three minute turns and you know going deep into overtime that it has been a long time. It's probably coming up two hours. <laughs> I can run back this guard. <laughs> Oh, this is where I should have been, he says. <laughs> a lot of pows all of a sudden. A yeah. lot of pows going on. Oh, Edge five cars. Brutal. Because, I mean, that's that's your retriever for next turn. Yeah. Oh, he's oh, picked up the ball. Oh, did yeah, he run out of mind. time? No, oh, maybe he didn't because he's in kind of an eye cage. but. Yeah, sort of, but that guard's in there. Yeah. And I guess even if you... But if you look at him, you just win, don't you? Like, so. Yeah. Oh, wow, he caught the ball. He did on a... <laughs> on a plot stepper. <laughs> That's not the worst player to catch the ball on. No, it's all right, isn't it? Is he just going to lob it and score? Yep. Yeah, here we go. Oh no! <laughs> Flip me, guys. Oh! Can he get the pass <laughs> off? In the crowd again! <laughs> oh, what the fuck? Oh, Nearly went back God. to him. <laughs> Jesus. Wow. What a crazy game. Yeah. What a crazy game. <laughs> oh, pick oh. Up. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> he had sure feet as well as double one. Oh my That's god. Oh yeah, he's got um sure feet, doesn't he? That's yeah. just a straight snake. Wow. But the elves don't have a re-roll, do they? Are they out of re-rolls? No, they still got one. Okay. Like oh my god, what a match. <laughs> that, was, that was a great watch, wasn't it? <laughs> it was. It's not over, Helenies. Sadly, it is now. Wow. Wow, what a wild, what a wild game. <laughs> yeah, enjoyed that one. <laughs> Zero turn ordering, let's just fucking go. <laughs> Yeah, amazing. Well, there you go. Commiserations, Odysseus. Congratulations, Alma. Thank you very much, Flicky, for being in the booth, being glorious. Very welcome. And uh, thanks for watching, everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.